Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Tonight I'm going to be in the garden photographing the Bubble Nebula. Now this is a, a target that I've wanted to photograph for quite some time, ever since seeing the footage that NASA released for the 26th anniversary of the Hubble telescope. It's the footage where you zoom in to the, the Bubble Nebula, so you travel through space, getting closer and closer to the Bubble Nebula itself. Such amazing footage, I have no idea how they produce it, but it's absolutely beautiful. Um, they also re released that really famous image of the Bubble Nebula, so I'm, I've wanted to photograph it for quite some time, and tonight I'm going to be in the garden collecting the oxygen data for this target. I've already collected the HA and the sulphur data, I did that over the last couple of weeks, so it's just the oxygen left to collect. There's only a 3% moon tonight, so hopefully it should be a good night to collect oxygen data. I'll put up the images from each of the narrowband filters, as well as the final image at the end of the video. If you've got any comments or any advice about how I can potentially go about doing this better, I'm quite new to this, so I'm sure I'm making a few mistakes, so any advice, any comments, um, I would really appreciate a comment below. So nothing left to do but go outside and set up. So it looks like the uh, weather forecast was wrong tonight. It was supposed to be clear all night um, from about 9 o'clock till um, probably about 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. Um, but there's just thick banks of cloud on the horizon. Um, as you can see, lots of cloud in the sky as well at the moment. So all set up, but I think I'm just going to pack it all in for tonight and hopefully it will clear up tomorrow. What do you think, Alfie? Clear skies? No? Should we go in? Should we call it quits? Or do you reckon the, the skies will clear? You're trying to listen to me, aren't you? What do you think? <laughs> 